and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team Video Guide. Today, I'm going to be going over a coin making method, a trading making method. It's any kind of thing you want to use it for, because essentially, that's exactly what it is. It's very universal, which is what I like about it. It's not one of those methods that you're stuck doing one thing. By the way, it is cost free for the most part. That's what a lot of people want to hear. I heard a lot of you guys, I heard you guys loud and clear in the last coin making method. You guys wanted something that didn't cost a lot of coins to do or cost any coins to you want to for like even startup players. So this one is very beneficial. You can do it any way you want. You can do it on one account, you can do it on multiple accounts. I'm gonna go over everything as we get through this video. Now guys, this method was brought to you guys by a subscriber. It's uh, it's the Dom is his name. Thank you so much, it's the Dom. Hit me up on Twitter, say what's up. I'm giving you the credit, remember guys, this came from a sub, so thank him. This helps you guys out. Now, before we get into the video, we go over the whole coin making method. Make sure to go down below, hit that subscribe button, turn that noti bell, boys. Come join the family. If you could so kindly, we're so close to 17k. Let's make it happen as soon as possible. Hopefully, today's video is pushed over the top. As well as comment down below if you guys have any recommendations on this coin method, if you have anything to add to it, or if you have any questions, or hit me up on Twitter if you need be. And guys, if you're here for Noti Gang, you're here at all. Can we get a thousand likes in this video? I've never had a thousand likes on a video. I feel like if there was ever a video to do it, it'd be this coin method. So, everyone watching right at this moment, like the video, comment down below, Noti Gang, if you came if you came here right away, and let me know what's up. But can we hit that like goal? That'd be awesome. If we hit the like goal, a thousand likes, I'll make sure to get another coin making method video to you guys out before the end of the week. And that's pretty much it, guys. Get into the method. So, first things first. Come over to play and challenges. We're gonna be focusing on the NFL 100 solo challenges once I find them. I did complete them, so they're probably somewhere all the way down here. NFL 100. Celebrate and honor some of the greatest players in 100 years of NFL history with these special challenges titling their biggest moments. Complete all challenges to earn a Nat Centennial pack. Now, it's not just about that pack. It's about whatever, what else, what else comes in here. So remember, every single one you did came with a pack, if you guys don't remember. Every single one came with a tier pack. So there was the NFL 100 halfbacks, the D-linemen, the linebackers, the D-linemen again, Linebackers, DB Special Fantasy Pack, DB Special Fantasy Pack, tight ends and alignment, alignment, wide receivers, and quarterbacks. Now, if you remember, you were able to pick one of each. So, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, most of these are like 84 to 85 overall. So, let's see. On my phone right here, I got the whole conversion chart. Barry Sanders was an 84. He quick sold for approximately 700 training, as well as they did increase. And you also get half, by the way. Remember, they are nat. And then, as you go up... There was the 85 ones, which quick sold for 970. So again, half is about four, let's go like four, 485. I think that's exact actually. So 485 and then 350. Those are like the two conversions you could get from these. So you earned one, two. Oh, let's see. Let's just start from the top. You earned one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nine. You earned nine total. So nine, let's give you an average of about 400. I'm not doing exact here. 400 times, I believe it was one, two, three. Oh, it's nine. It's tier nine. Nine of them. So that leaves you with 3,600 training. Now, coins for training is about 12. So you times that by 12. That's about 43,000 coins. And that's just a cherry on top. The main aspect is the Nat Centennial Fantasy Pack. By the way, guys, these solos take maybe 25 minutes. So you can knock out all solos in about 25 minutes. They're super quick. I'm not even joking. Every solo is like, a few, like two, three minutes each. 20, I'll get 25 to an hour, depending on how slow how quickly you beat them you know they're not they're not hard you don't have to play them easy doesn't matter so let's do the first run around of this method when you go through this the first time you're going to end up being able to pick any single player you want so you end up remember you're gonna end up with 43,000 coins worth of training as well as a nat centennial fantasy pack so if you already do this on your main account i recommend you go make a farm account so the, the way this works is with five farm accounts so guys i don't want to hear that's too hard you want coins you want free coins this is the way to do it farm accounts are not hard Farm accounts take no more than three to four minutes to set up. You type in a fake email, write down the password, you're, you're in, and you go right into Madden. It's, it's very simple. It's not, it's not a hard thing to, to, to implore and do. Now, you're going to want to take the 95 overall players out of the pack every time because they're going to offer you the most training gain. So 95 Randy Moss quick sells for 25,200. So you get back approximately 12,600 training. 12,600 training on average, if you were to convert it, converts to about 151,000 coins plus the 45 ish thousand coins you got from the other players. You end up at on average of about 200k per account. Now, there's multiple ways to bring this about. First, you could 
Transfer Randy Moss. If you could trade her. Oh, actually, are they non auctionable, non tradable? Are they non tradable as well? Point is here, besides them being Nat, is that you have two ways to do this. You can you can convert it on the account you're on and work it that way, or you can transfer it over. So if you're feeling ballsy, you can transfer the coins and everything over directly. Or if you want to, if you want to be smart about it, here's a smart way. Because a lot of you guys can be like, I don't want to transfer coins over. I'll show you that way now. So once you end up with Randy Moss and your players, you're gonna end up about 200k worth of trading. You're gonna have 12,600 plus 3,600, which is about 16,200 total. Is about where you're gonna end up with trading. So there's two things you can do. While we're in the store, we're gonna head over to trading currency. So remember, you have about 16,200 to play with here. So you could potentially open up about a little over four. So you can open up about four heavyweight packs. So four heavyweight packs guarantees you 88 pluses. You could also do a football outsider. Football outsiders, you would only be able to open exactly three. So, but the football outsiders go up to 87 to 92s. Heavyweights are guaranteed 88 plus. So there's two ways to look at this. Okay, so the heavyweight pack, the way you're gonna end up doing this. Well, by the way, if you're feeling really risky, you could do the 83 pluses, but I do not recommend that. But the heavyweight packs, so let's say you open up about four, right? Let's say you pull. You need you if you get pulls above 89s, 89s or above, you're set. If you get 88s, it's gonna be a little bit different, but we'll work with it. So, first thing you want to do is you want to open that four times. Now, let's say you get, you end up with about, give or take, let's say, I want to say at least two. I think you're gonna get at least three things over an 89, at least because they go up to like 92s now. So you're gonna you're gonna obviously put something pretty good. But let's just say heavyweight cards. And the price they're going for. Remember, a lot of you guys don't like transferring coins directly because you're scared of being shadow banned or anything. So we have to always work with that. So let's see. The 88s to 89s start at about, let's refresh here, about 36,000 coins. So worst case scenario, right? You pull four 88s. Those all convert for about 36K, 33 after reduction, times that by four. 132,000 coins. Plus, you have some trading left over. That is the first way. Now let's say you pull some 89s. 89s go for about about 50k. So let's go with 45k. 45,000 coins times times four is 180,000 coins. That's if you want to sell and transfer them directly over. Most people are too scared to actually transfer coins directly over. So that is for all you guys who don't mind. You know, you go up, you go up on your main account, you post the card, and you buy for 180,000 coins. That is the first way to do it. Now the safer way that people are going to be asking, how can I transfer without getting in trouble? So pretty much. More than likely, you'll end up pulling a few things above 89. So if you pull a few things above 89, you're coming over to sets. And you're going to toss them in. So now, here's the thing. Let's say you pull 289s and 288s. I'd recommend you sell the 288s, you buy 89, and you do it this way too. That's the other way to do it. That, that's, that's if you end up pulling 288s. And you do, but obviously, I think you're going to pull more things. Now, if you pull at least 289s, you can put the, if you pull at least 289s or above, or 289s or 90s, you can put them right here. You toss all three in, and then you get a 91 to 92 overall player, which does give you a great chance at Legends, Full Legends, and Redux cards. You could pull like free, uh, you could pull Redux Randy Moss, Redux Aaron Donald, Redux um, Deion Sanders, Redux Kittle. So it's a great way to make upwards of 200k coins. This is like the gamble set. At minimum, you'll probably end up making about 100 something k here, which isn't the greatest return, but it's still great considering this took you about 25 minutes to an hour for 100k. But on average, I'd say you end up making about 200k. Now let's just say you do the say you still have a fourth card, right? What do you do with it? You sell it for coins. That you can transfer over. You can transfer over 30k. You're not gonna get caught for that. You can just transfer over 30k, put a card in your main account for 30k, and then buy it from this account. Now, what if you pull, what if you hit what if you hit bangers, right? And you end up with like four 92s. In that case, sell all the 92s, right? Sell all the 92s. Either convert the coins right over, or if you don't want to do that, you can just go ahead and sell them all let's say they all go for about like 100k or at least close to it, probably like yeah about 100k i'd say you sell all of them you end up with like 300k or whatever after reduction 350 and then you just go buy a bunch of 88s and you do the set as many times as you want that's one way to do it now let's say you really just want to go for you want to go for it all you could always open some football outsider cards hoping that you hit the kit you hit big on the kicker or something and just sell it but heavyweights seem pretty safe because they're 88 no matter what so you're definitely guaranteed an 88 which is great so it's up to you. The coin route where you just directly sell them and you go ahead and do it, net you X amount of dollars doing the set X. The set's just a bit safer. The set might be a little more tedious, but it's but the coins are easier. It's up to you on exactly how you want to go about this. But this method is pretty foolproof, guys. So let's see. I say on average, you get about 200K from doing this method per account. Because remember, you get 
about 200k worth of training each time. Now the way you convert it's big. So to just check the prices and everything, you cannot pull a 92. You can pull a 91 though, which is still, like I said, almost 100k. So the math still applies. Disregard the 92. The math will still apply no matter how you look at it. So saying the 92 did not net affect anything. It's still going to be a 92. A 91 does go for about 9200k. So the math is still the same thing. So let's say you pull, I'd say a few 91s and some 89s and a 90. At best case scenario, you could easily pull about two to 300k doing this. Best case scenario, probably 300k. So 300k doing this, not bad. Worst case scenario, you probably end up pulling around 120k. So between 120k to 300k per account. Now, if you do this over five accounts, so let's say you get the worst return on all five accounts, 120,000 times five, you end up with 600k. Great return. Let's say you pull 250 on each account, which would be like the average, I'd have to say, on even the best returns. You could easily get upwards to 1.25 million. And let's say the best possible 300k every time, 1.5 million. So between 600k and 1.5 million. That is a solid thing. I'd say it probably, if you want to do all five accounts, it'll probably take you like three to four hours. Not hard at all. I highly recommend you do this. Best advice I can give you guys. Hope you guys did enjoy this method. Hope it helps you guys. If you're new to the channel, go down below. Hit that subscribe button. I greatly appreciate it if you guys could come join the family. Let's hit 70k as soon as possible. Also, Noted Gang, whoever's watching, smash the like button. Can we get a thousand likes for the first time on our YouTube career on this on this video? I greatly appreciate that. And shout out to It's the Dom for this method, or for a variation of it at least. You're the you're the man. Thank you so much for helping. Hope, you, hope this helps you guys out. If this did help you guys out, comment down below. If you have any variations to make more coins on this, comment down below. I'm out. See you guys next video. Peace.